Hello, I'm Dr. Barnes, and I wanted to introduce myself to you. Um, in case you're searching for me online, I own three uh, websites. I operate them, of course. Uh, this is the first one, uh, NathanBarnes.us. You can see it up here at the top. Um, this is my personal blog. Um, I do not update it very often. It was designed to be basically an online resume uh, when I was looking for jobs, but I still operate it just in case um, I need to keep it you know, keep everything up to date, and most of it is, but you'll look here, um, the last time I updated it was October 31st, 2012, and I updated it again uh, September 9th, 2013, so you, it's almost a year uh, between updates, but uh, I do keep this up, and you can read some of my dissertation and see my teaching philosophy, my uh, older uh, curriculum uh, vitae CV, and uh, my current projects from a year ago. But uh, that's, that's the old one. The new one is here, uh, NathanBarnes.com, and has a little dash in the middle. Um, I'm a professional editor uh, by trade, so this is my online portfolio. Um, basically, it tells you that all of my energies, uh, almost all of my energies online, are dedicated to my job. So uh, you can familiarize yourself with me through my work if you want to. Um, these are the publishers I work with and you can see my uh, published works and my you know my edited works mostly and then my few publications uh, I'm publishing a book soon uh, it is on 1st Corinthians and uh, Greco-Roman philosophy and it's basically uh, the launch pad was basically women in philosophy and the agon motif which is the race uh, in 1st Corinthians uh, 9 27 or so and you can read an approximation of that. Um, the journal would not let me post my actual journal, but uh, that's me, and you can explore this website if you desire, but uh, this is where I am online uh, if you're looking. Um, and also I have a site dedicated to my uh, kids. I'm having twins, and uh, I have updated it pretty recently. November 5th I'm going to update it uh, probably tonight or tomorrow uh, with some uh, finished pictures of the of the nursery. This is a before picture. Uh, that's what I've been working on tirelessly for the past couple of days. See a really cute picture of my boy uh, having a little girl also. So anyway, this is my uh, second website. Um, my dog, the pregnancy test, you know, just stuff in case you want to uh, uh, get to know me a little better. Uh, this is where you do it. So uh, that being said, I want to let you know some things about my videos. For one thing, you'll see that I always wear a hat. I'm going to go turn on the light real quick. Okay. Why does Dr. Barnes wear a hat? Well, this is why. Watch this. I'm bald, and I can't see myself right now, but I know it, there's a really bad glare up here. So I graduated from TCU. You'll always see me wearing a TCU hat. I also graduated from Wayland. I have two degrees from Wayland, and I love Wayland with all my heart, but it's been 13 years, and uh, all of my hats from Wayland are gone or have worn out, so uh, wear a TCU hat. Also, you'll see me wearing these glasses. These are called gaming glasses after games. Um, you know, a lot of 40-year-old uh, men uh, living in their mother's basements playing video games 24 hours a day wear these which is why they're called gaming glasses. So I wear them because, as you've seen, I'm an editor, and I edit uh, about 16 hours a day, uh, seven days a week. So uh, you'll see me wearing these glasses because my eyes get tired, and uh, if I don't wear them, um, I will be squinting. And sometimes I can't find them, and you'll see me squinting in the videos. So anyway, that is me, and I uh, hope you have a good time this semester. We're going to learn a lot.